you're getting prepared for the NFL draft. I mean, this must be an exciting moment for you. It's very exciting and very blessed to be in the position I am right now. I've only been around this game for six years, so it's just uh, kind of crazy the story I've had and what I had to go through to get here. Six years? Yeah, tell me a little bit about that story. Like, you growing up and not really getting into football until later. Uh, so my junior year, that summer, my uh, both my grandparents, my grandmother and grandfather passed away. That senior year, I kind of like took it upon myself to play in their name. And from there, it went up. Talk about the recruiting process then, because you didn't get into football until later. Uh, did that have an effect on the recruiting process? Uh, it, it had an effect when you want to like talk about like big power five schools. But as far as Division II, I've got I got offers from a lot of them. So then I took the liberty of going to Fairmont State. That uh, COVID year, where everybody else got to play, I didn't get to play. I didn't have a season that fall or that spring. I was talking to my family and everybody about it. And we decided that it was best if I get a bit better education, but also play better competition. What made you just hone in on just NC State? They called me every day, made me feel welcome. and. Like I was a part of the team, even though I couldn't have an official visit, it just it just clicked from the get-go. I'm kind of already good with my nutrition. It's sort of like just getting a routine. The food might not be the best, but you gotta think of it for the long run, not just the short-term goals. But I mean, someone that does make some pretty delicious food would be your father. <laughs> I've, I've done some homework. And I yeah. realized that he's a chef. Talk to me about that. And he's actually a successful chef as well. Yes, sir. Uh, so he's one chopped, I want to say, twice or three times. Twice. Yeah. So his, he had a big influence when it came to my like, nutrition. Because coming out of high school, it was about like, 240, 250. So he put me on a pretty uh, big diet coming out of high school. This journey now, going into the NFL, what are you most excited about? Is it the uh, possibility of like getting drafted to a team that you love? Is it um, preparing for the NFL Combine? Is it meeting up individually with teams? What excites you? Everything excites me about the whole process. I'm just blessed to, I would go to any team. The draft process, I mean, top 1% get to be in this position I am right now. So I'm just very, blessed and to be a part of this and you just gotta take it little by little and don't get so overwhelmed through the things that you have to go through in order to get drafted. Come on! Why is Chandler Zavala capable of being a starting offensive guard in the NFL? Many people look at me for just being a big mauler just because I'm very strong and I'm 6'4 and a half on the field and weighing 323 but as teams got to really watch and see me my agility and speed is no different than anyone being 298. You're going to get the best offensive lineman in the draft, and as he gets to play, one of the best offensive linemen ever to play this game, even though he's only been playing for six years. He will always have a chip on his shoulder because he has to work on his technique and body in order to be the best he can be.